Welcome back, everybody, to another Gator Q&A. Now, this is a segment where all you dumbasses out there ask me stupid-ass questions, and I give you my stupid-ass answers. Well, I'm super excited, I'm sure you are as well, so let's get to the first question. First question comes from Jerron Moore. He says, how does it feel being a gay retard? You know, when I first set out to do a YouTube channel, I really only had one goal in mind. See, I always knew that I was gay, and I always kind of knew I was a retard. But what I wanted to do was to somehow combine both these aspects of myself into one solid thing. So finally, I accomplished my goal when I created this YouTube channel. Next question comes from Colgate Rob. And he asks, how does it feel to be mentally challenged and to not have a real job? Well, first off, buddy, I do have a real job. As a matter of fact, I have two of them. So in your fucking face, bitch. Also, thank you for using the correct terminology to describe me. Uh, mentally challenged. Thank you. Oh, I got a question for you. You want a question? Well, here goes nothing. Why in the infinite spectrum? Why in the vast expanse of this galaxy why are we here right now why are we wasting our time making shitty videos hmm very good question you know why we are here is very simple see our parents fucked one another why we do shitty videos well that's because we really enjoy it and we love it for some fuck all reason there are other people out there that enjoy it as well so fuck it let's make them liquid dinosaur asks what does your beard taste like Boss, obviously. Bob is a villain ass. If you had a power to consume literally anything for a day, where would you go and what would you consume? Well, first, I'd have to go to your mom's house and then I'd have to consume that pussy. Fail. But for real, I'd go wherever Ryan Gosling is and we'd enjoy a nice deep dish Chicago pizza. All right, next up, we have a video from Lewis. <clears throat> Why are you such a faggot? Obviously because I like dicks and hairy chests. Next question. Gator, have you seen Chef? <sighs> that question was from Ravi Games, and yes, Ravi, I've seen Chef. I've said multiple times that I've seen Chef, not only in videos, but in the comments section of just about everybody. I even took it a step further to create a Gator's Corner episode where I reviewed the movie Chef and gave my input on how I truly felt about it. So yes, Robbie Games, I, I've seen Chef. I fucking, i seen it. i fucking seen it. Dawid has Nick asks, how was the change from managing the channel with Poon and now only by yourself? Was it hard? Um, I mean, to be honest with you, no, not really. Even when Poon and that guy were both on the channel, I did everything. I did the filming, I did the editing, I did the putting it out, I did everything. I did all of it, the whole entire time. They just showed up and just said some bullshit. I tried to script something a couple of times for them, and they wouldn't even read that. That was mostly Lewis, or that guy, whatever. Anyway, so no, it wasn't difficult. The hard part was just going from doing it with your friends and stuff and having a good time to just doing it by yourself. All right, for this next question, I did cheat, and I wrote some stuff down, so I'm going to read it from here. Um, I just, it's an awesome question where I get a shout out some channels that I love and I enjoy watching and I want them to make more videos so I want you guys to go watch them and shit too. But Jake Arbiter asks, Gator, what YouTube channels do you enjoy? And my favorite bar none is Boogie2988 uh, with iDubs TV being a close second. You all know why I love him on top of him being absolutely hilarious. And the biggest thing about these two guys that I really, really love is how unique they are. They have a unique brand. Um, of what they do, what they have out there on YouTube. You can't really find anybody that does what they do the way they do, uh, which is awesome, and I love it. I love seeing something new all the time, and so they're my top two. And also, in no particular order, a bunch of channels I love, Yuri Dick Milk, Jer Bear, Yesterday, Yesterland Wants, Chainax25, Bums Tube, G Money, Van Berman, uh, Drezakio, and The Pickle Enterprise which I believe all of these you can find on my Awesomes channel bar on the side of my page when you go there. Go check out their pages. Sub, sub to all these guys. They're all awesome, and they work hard for you, so check them out. I have no idea, ass. If you could visit any country for a week, which one would you go to? Well, for me, that's pretty easy. I've always wanted to go to Ireland my entire life. It would just be cool to go see all that shit, so yeah, Ireland. Now for another video question. Dr. J-Boss here. 
Do you suffer from mild retardation? Wow. Well, you know, I'm not sure mild is the word I would use. To two ninety-eight zebras two wants to know if you had to choose one, which would it be? Fuck I dubs and let him fuck you, or kill twenty puppies who can understand what you say and love you. This question was actually quite easy for me. I knew the answer immediately. I would obviously fuck I dubs and let him fuck me back, and then together we would go kill those twenty puppies. Knee on TV, knee on TV. Ask how do you feel about two K subs? Honestly, I feel absolutely amazed. I pinch myself every freaking time that I see it because I go to the page a million times a day and I constantly see it and I fucking just freak out and I love it. It's awesome. I keep waking up every morning to find out that all of you have left me and that I'm all alone and uh, I would completely understand and still be completely grateful and happy that any of you ever watched me to begin with. So fucking awesome is how I feel. Anonymous9001 ask, how is the consistency of your stools today? I'd have to say gooey, uh, but also a bit sticky. Uh, uh, I, my, my, my name is Gus, and uh, I, uh, I, 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 have a, I have a question. Uh, what, what's your, uh, what, uh, what's your, uh, what's your favorite, uh, What's your what's your what's your, uh, what's your what's your favorite m movie? What what's your favorite movie? <sighs> well, Gus, that's pretty easy. It's gonna have to be Inception. I just feel like it hits it out of the park on every category. You know, the graphics, the acting, the storyline, everything. It's just a phenomenal movie, and I could rewatch it every single day for the rest of my life. Yep, six seventy five asks, "Do you love me?" Oh, come on, girl, don't play. You know I do. And the last question of the day today is a video question. <laughs> wow, sirs. I mean, it's pretty freaking obvious. Don't stab yourself in the stomach. I mean, if what you're trying to avoid is you know, your entire life fucking sucking and shit, like, you just don't fucking, don't stab yourself. You know, and then your existence will be awesome. So if I can stop stabbing yourself, just fucking stop it. Stop it. Don't you see the blood coming out of your mouth? It's stupid. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I always enjoy doing the Q and A's. Uh, special thanks to JBuzz TV for sending in uh, all four of those video questions. Absolutely hilarious. Uh, I hope you guys go check out his page as well. And I hope you all had a great time. And as always, I've been the Gator, and you've been great. Peace. I eat shit on my tacos in front of small children. I make a mess and then I throw an unusual tantrum. Why can't I only fit two dicks in my ass? My meme, yeah. My meme, yeah.